Everything that lives is designed to end. We are perpetually trapped in a never-ending spiral of life and death. Is this a curse? Or some kind of punishment? I often think about the god who blessed us with this cryptic puzzle, and wonder if we'll ever have the chance to kill him. Yorha Squadron, come in. To be here. All units have penetrated the stratosphere. Autopilot systems green across the board. This is Operator 60. All units confirmed. We've passed the 50 kilometer threshold and are proceeding toward the target. Understood. Once you reach their anti air defenses, proceed to manual attack formation. Then destroy the Goliath class unit by any means necessary and gather what data you can. Understood. Twelve H down. All units activate manual mode and rely on visuals to evade. Already engaged. Free movement unlocked. Origin point of long range lasers confirmed. Eleven B down. Our HO two two nine cancelers are ineffective. Alert. Enemy unit sighted ahead. Requesting permission to engage. Permission granted. Seventy down. Surrounding enemy air units confirmed. Requesting permission to assume mobile configuration. Permission granted.
Captain, I think... 4B Town. To be to Operator 6-0. All Allied units down. The operation is compromised. Awaiting further orders. Uh, operator to 2B. We need you to rendezvous with Unit 9S and begin gathering data on the local terrain. Understood. Activating short range attack gear. Alert. Large enemy group detected. Yes, I'm aware of that.
objectives destroyed. Not quite. Is that our target? Negative. This enemy is unrelated. Proposal. Dispatch it as swiftly as possible. You don't say. Better make sure he's actually dead next time. That was dangerous, man. You're 2B, right? My name's 9S. I'm here to provide support. Copy that. So, was that big old buzzsaw the Goliath you came here to take out? No, just another defensive system. Oh, well, uh, I guess we have to find the target then, huh? I've got a flight unit, so I'll take a look around the perimeter. All right. I'll work my way inside from the ground.
What is it? I was going to send you the map data I collected earlier. Do it. So open it. Negative. Nearby enemies are jamming our signal. Nothing's ever easy. Glad you're here. Why? Scanners like me mostly work alone. Scouting out enemy lines and all that. I don't usually get a partner. It's kind of fun. Emotions are prohibited. <laughs> Sorry, ma'am. And another thing. Stop calling me ma'am. Huh? It's unnecessary. All right, then. To be it is.
Jesus, this elevator's controls are locked and cannot be used. This place sure is big. I guess humans used to use it as a weapons factory, but now it's just crawling with machines. The enemy seems to have repurposed the facility to increase their overall machine production. So if we don't destroy it, they'll just keep coming. Accessing random, nonsensical data from the old world. There's no actual meaning behind anything machines do.
Navigator's controls are locked and cannot be used. Alert! Bulletproof apparatus detected on enemies. Close range combat is advised. I know. the entire factory, but couldn't find anything resembling our target. Maybe they... I don't know, moved it somewhere? Is that...? You mean, the birds? Yeah, there's more plants and animals here than there used to be. Probably because the environment's changed.
There should be another facility across that bridge. It's a bit of a hike, but should we check it out? It's not like Command to get a location wrong. I guess even they get bad intel from time to time, huh? Hmm. I wouldn't bet on that. Detected. What's your status? 
This is the target. I'm going to destroy it. Uh, right. I'll provide support. Alert. Incoming enemy attack from below. Proposal. Evade. black box signal detected no response to communications i'm going after him send a support request to command negative communications have been jammed I have to repair him. Pod, get me staunching gel and logic virus vaccines. Then access the- Inadvisable. The subject's vital signs are too poor to attempt field repair. Shut current... up! Just do what I say! To be... Just go. Me, you shut up too. We... we're soldiers. We take pride in our service. HO-229 Flight Unit. Command 677 received. Usage rights transferred from 9S to 2B. Requesting acknowledgement. Please...
had that kind of intelligence. To be... I found a weakness in the target. Hacking in... to provide support. To be... the control... of the enemy's upper arm. You should pause. Should be able to take it over. I told you to shut up! Control of upper arm. Seized from enemy unit. Marking weak point. System. Affirmative. Infiltrating enemy subunit. Behavior table adjusted. Balance controls overridden. Enemy unit subjugation complete. Talk about bringing the battle to them. Ought to be. Contact command. Request assistance. No. It doesn't look like that's going to be necessary. Oh, great. That <coughs> this is going to end well. The black box, it's ready. Right. <coughs> Requesting. Destruction of enemy hostiles via black box reaction. Request accepted. Tubi, it was an honor to fight with you. Truly. The honor was mine. So, mission complete and all that, huh? The Goliaths were wiped out, and we secured a route into enemy territory. Now we can... 9S. Yeah? Thank you. For uploading my data to the bunker. Um, I did that? Sorry, I don't remember. 
There wasn't a whole lot of bandwidth down there, you know. I probably only had enough time to back up your memories. Mine are only intact up to the point just before we rendezvoused. I see. Glory to mankind. Glory to mankind. Fifty twelve AD. The year mankind's glorious history came to a sudden and abrupt end, when the world was invaded by aliens from beyond the stars. The aliens unleashed a new breed of weapon, machine life forms, that all but annihilated human civilization. The handful of survivors that remained fled from Earth, seeking refuge on the moon. Fifty two oh four AD. Humanity launched its counterattack, deploying an army of androids from a network of orbiting bases. But after more than a dozen large-scale descents upon the enemy, we still haven't managed to repel the invaders. That is why you, the Yorha forces, exist. To break this stalemate, once and for all. You are our ultimate weapon. And you must put an end to this war. Understood, sir. I wish you good hunting. Glory to mankind. Glory to mankind. Glory to mankind. Are you there? Can you hear me? All right, are we good now? Okay, settings should all be good to go. Uh, hold on, your self-destruct permissions are missing. Wait a sec, we need to restore those. I could set it for you, but you should probably do it yourself. Regulations and all, you know? Huh? Wait, no. You need to leave that turned on. Yeah, you can't really do that. It needs to be turned on, except in very specific cases. I'm afraid I can't leave this as is, ma'am. Please give your permission. Hey, come on now. I'm just trying to follow regulations here. Hey, come on now. I'm just trying to follow... Okay, good. If things go wrong during an op, you may have to sacrifice yourself in order to finish it. So, once you're finished making adjustments, you can go ahead and close this out. Morning. Nine S. The commanders put me in charge of your maintenance, ma'am. 
That means I'll be performing regular checks on you from now on. I see. Oh, don't worry. We 9S models are the best around, you know. Though I suppose we're not exactly known for our modesty. 9S. Hmm? What is it, ma'am? Stop calling me ma'am. Huh? There's no need to be so formal. Uh, all right. If you say so. Oh, I almost forgot. The commander was calling for you. We better go see what's up, ma'am. Er, to be. You need to be near an access point to save your data. 
You can see access points on the close range map. Be sure to save often. To be. Maintenance finished? Yes, Commander. You detonated your black box in order to defeat the enemy. Bold, but risky. Try not to be so reckless next time. Understood. I know you're fresh out of maintenance, but I have another mission for you. I need you to head to the surface, rendezvous with the Resistance, and do some recon. Doesn't Yorha have a dedicated Resistance contact already? We haven't been able to get in touch with them, so we'll need you to look into that as well. Understood. surface? That means we'll be getting flight units, huh? Better head for the hangar. <laughs> Usually we can't get near flight units. They're way too expensive for us grunts. Too bad they can't mass produce these things yet. The hangar's up ahead. Let's go. that model like you to a recon job. If all they want is intel, we scanner models are built for that kind of thing. Orders are orders. All right, all right. Tubi, you're going to have some new weaponry installed from here on out. I'll put up instructions for you. Make sure to commit them to memory. Roger.
32B, come in. I've set a landing point for your flight units. You'll be touching down quite a ways from the Resistance camp, unfortunately. Sorry for the trouble, but we can't risk the enemy discovering their position. Understood. Good luck down there.
Target location acquired. Marking on map. Proposal. Proceed to target location.
So this is the resistance camp, huh? We should probably go talk to their leader first thing. from the system menu. To be? Um, yes, well, the bunker told me to expect you. My name is Anemone. I'm the leader of the android resistance that controls most of this territory. You must be the new scouts we heard about. Well, I'm sure my people will have plenty of information for you. Please feel free to ask them anything you like. Target location data obtained. Marking on map.
This must have been quite a city once upon a time. Too bad vegetation's claimed most of it now. Operator 60 to 2B. It is time for your regularly scheduled contact. This is 2B. Nothing to report. Good to hear. Say, how's the weather on Earth today? Good? It's fine. Does that question have anything to do with our operation? Not really. I just figured it might feel nice to have some good weather. Feeling nice has no bearing on completing missions. <laughs> that is so like you to be. Anyway, talk to you later.
042 to operator. Coordinates confirmed for location specified by resistance leader. Understood, 042. Placing marker on target. The desert heat is going to make resupply efforts difficult, 2B. Please make sure you're ready before you go.
You're from Yorha, right? I've heard about you guys. We've got a squad mate waiting in a rocky stretch up ahead. Head on over. Just remember that there's nowhere to resupply out there. If you need anything, best to take care of it here while you can. What can I help you with? are always so stiff. Report. Mail notification received from access point. Our leader told me all about you. Name's Jackass. Nice to meet you. I hear you're planning to take out all the machines in the desert? Guess that means we need to get that entrance open. Looks like it. So, um, Jack... ass, was it? Uh, what are you doing all the way out here? Hmm? Oh, that? Well... Wouldn't want to have anyone getting tangled up in that, now would we? Don't go trying to be a hero, all right? Who opens a sealed gate with explosives? There's got to be an easier way, right? This sand sure is slippery. Careful. We've got enemies approaching. These machines are talking. 
Yeah, I heard from the Resistance that they've been seeing this a lot lately. Couldn't tell you why, though. understand the concept of being scared? Jamming caused by enemies in local vicinity. What's with the weird-looking outfits? I've seen that sort of thing when I was going through some old data. It looks like what humans used to wear long ago. Certain human collectives used to use face paint like that, too.
To be, it's fine. Their speech doesn't mean anything. They're just emitting words at random. If they wanted help, why would they be attacking us? Yeah. It's heading for that rocky area. Individual target ID marked. What's that? Analysis. It is the ruin of a former human residential area. Large numbers of humans resided in such concrete and metal shelters. The structures were referred to by names such as apartment complex. Report. Mail notification received from access point.
An android? No, this... This is a machine!
a machine? Not another one. Stopped. Looks like we're safe now. What the hell just happened? I know. I've never seen a machine like that before. We better report this to command.
hear you kicked some tin can ass out in the desert. So I guess, you know, thanks or whatever. Hey, welcome back. Thanks for securing it. I know it isn't... Oh, and be sure to swing by if you ever need anything. What can I help you with? I think we've earned a breather. Say 2B, I was hoping we could talk about our next move. I'm worried about the damage we took in that last battle with the machines. Maybe we should return to the resistance camp to resupply and conduct maintenance? No, we should keep fighting. Roger that. Just try not to overdo it, okay? Operator to 9S. Data upload complete. Roger. I also have an incoming message from the commander. Initiating playback. 2B, 9S. We've lost contact with several Yorha units that were on their way to the surface. Their black boxes are online, so we presume they're still alive. We've tracked the location of their signals, so I need all Yorha units on the surface to head over and investigate. End transmission. Hmm. I heard something about that back at the Resistance camp. Target location confirmed. I'm worried about the other androids. We should probably check this out as soon as possible.
Looks like our surface route's been cut off. Maybe we can get through from underground. So, 2B, those machines out in the desert look just like androids, right? Right. But we androids were modeled after our human creators. So why would machines try to look like us? Hmm. There's no point trying to work out unsolvable problems. I suppose.
this? Some kind of crystal? Analysis. It is a core fragment from the machine life form. It is similar in structure to a plant cell. A plant cell?
Thanks for the assist. Oh, you mean the hacking? No worries. Us scanners are pretty good at that kind of thing. I've got your back anytime. We have to save those androids. I'm sorry, 2B. Their circuits are fried. I think they were only being kept alive by that enemy. Oh.
So, um... What is it? That machine had some pretty weird things to say, huh? It's almost like it had actual emotion. The machines don't have feelings. You said that yourself. Yeah, I... I guess.
They all have white flags. Looks like they really don't want to fight. Hello. Before we begin, there's something you must understand. We are not your enemies. To be! We can't trust anything the machines say. I understand that you see us as the enemy, but... Well, anyway, my name is Pascal. I'm the leader of this village. Those who reside here desire nothing more than to live a peaceful existence. Look around for yourself. You'll see that it's true. She sure cares about her little sister, huh? Still, it's pretty funny to hear machines talk about siblings. Do you think she just means they were built at the same factory or something? Maybe.
to be. Time for your regularly scheduled contact. <laughs> to be here. What's wrong? Oh. There's this operator I kind of liked, but when I asked her out, she turned me down. <laughs> Honestly, to be. I am definitely not the person to discuss this with. I don't think I can stand spending one more day in this bunker. You leaving would be bad for me. It would affect mission efficiency. Uh, are you saying you need me to be? All Model B combat units require the assistance of an operator. So... To be? And that's all. Closing this channel.
We can get into the city ruins if we move that box.
What do you think? <laughs> he just started transmitting to us directly. Now do you believe we're not a threat? Your mouth can say anything it wants, but you still don't have a heart. I suppose that's technically accurate. Yes, well, you're free to visit our village whenever you like.
Is this the music box she was looking for? Man, this thing is all rusted over. Look, a corpse. You think the box belonged to her? Poor girl died a long time ago by the looks of it. Let's bring this back to her friend.
Operator to 2B. Come in, 2B. We need you to collect the materials required to improve the network environment. You're going to need a rusty bolt, a small gear, and a spring. You should be able to find them on the small-sized enemies. Once you have everything, please take it to the Resistance Leader, Anemone. Understood. I know it's a bit of a pain, but good luck. Target location data obtained. Marking on map. Operator 60 to 2B. Looks like you found all the necessary parts to improve our network environment. Nice work. You can conclude your mission by bringing everything over to Anemone.
To B to Operator 60. Material handover complete. Copy that. Good work. I see the commander's as much of a slave driver as ever. It's like she was built to be as efficient and hard-assed as possible. Oh, she's not so bad. But are you serious? Totally serious. The commander actually lets a lot of things slide on the side. Like, did you know that she leaves piles of clothes strewn everywhere? The cleaning team is so sick of it. Oh, and she never performs regular maintenance on herself. A lot of the hard-ass nature you mention is just for show. How do you know all this? <laughs> I can't tell you that. Operator 60, out. What the heck was all that about? What's that noise? 2B, this is an emergency transmission from the bunker. We're reading a Goliath-class enemy inside the city ruins. And it looks like there are a ton of other machines there with it. All Yorha units should proceed and engage immediately. A Goliath? This was a trap. I knew it! I promise you, we were not aware of this information. I realize the odds of you believing me are strikingly low. But I hope you will, nonetheless. 
We'll sort it out later. Let's go. To be. Command is deploying new flight units for us. They just set the coordinates, so let's get going. On it. Probably shouldn't get near that guy's feet. Yeah, no. Let's find another route. Flight units should be on the roof of that building up ahead. It'll be dangerous, but we're not going anywhere unless we pass through that Goliath's legs. We should be careful.
Mosquito and Central Wiring Hub. those flight units while we can. Be careful. The skies are packed with anti-air weapons. Make sure to approach at low altitude. Copy that. Target enemies offline. That should do it for the Goliaths. Look out! It's recharging! Enemy 
vibrations are growing in intensity. It's resonating in tandem with the area beneath the combat zone. <laughs> Unbelievable. The aliens who haven't revealed themselves in hundreds of years were hiding underground? We've intercepted a signal belonging to the aliens. These are the creatures that are in direct command of the machine life forms on this planet. If we can destroy them, we can end this long and arduous war once and for all. Our intel team is hard at work attempting to analyze the source of the signal, but we're not there yet. We need more data. All Yorha units are hereby ordered to prioritize data collection above all else. We can't let this chance slip through our fingers. Glory to mankind. I used Command's data to determine the signal's source and marked it on the map. But it seems to be underground. Like, way underground. Guess we'll see once we get there. If we're lucky. You're not much for plans, are you, 2B? received from access point. Operator 60 to 2B. Be aware that the following transmission is classified privilege level 5. A group of Yorha fighters deployed to the city ruins have deserted. We need you to take care of them immediately. But don't get yourself hurt, alright? Yorha members deserting? And attacking the resistance no less? <sighs> Rapunzel. Rogue Yorha units should be captured and detained in order to keep collateral damage at a minimum. Detained? Easy for you to say.
alert. Signal code detected for missing plug-in chip. Marking approximate location on map. To be. Hmm? This machine is still alive. So destroy it. Maybe we should hold off. Its main drive has been trashed, so there's no way it can attack us. And we might be able to learn something interesting if we study it. data obtained. Marking on map. You know, I'm still not sure any of this is a good idea. The more data we have, the better, right? on the race.
Hmm, these places look familiar. One looks like the amusement park, one looks like the desert, and one looks like the forest. Let's keep our eyes open next time we're in any of those areas. What is this? Analysis. It is a cave-in caused by the collapse of an open space underground. That's a weird-looking enemy. That's a weird looking enemy.
What was all that about? No idea.
What is this? Analysis. It is a cave-in caused by the collapse of an open space underground. Why is there such a huge cavern beneath the city? I don't. 
That's a weird looking enemy. This hallway looks pretty old.
Look at all these dead machines. Seems like they've been here for a long time. What is this place? I don't know. There's nothing like it in the database. Be. Look! Destroyed alien motherships. Welcome <laughs> to the graveyard of our creators. You! To be! Look out! My name is Adam. The aliens you seek are no longer here. They were wiped out so Hey? Can I kill him yet? Relax, Eve. We're still negotiating here. <laughs> Fine. They were wiped out centuries ago. By us. The machines. Wiped out? And who knows? Perhaps we'll wipe out the androids next. Machines are weapons capable of evolution. We can grow. We can become aware. Eventually, the intelligence within our network began to surpass that of our creators. You'd probably be surprised at how quickly it happened. You destroyed your own creators? Oh, there's no need to fret about them. They were simple, infantile, almost like plants, I guess you'd say. They held no value to us. But the humans on the moon? Now they are interesting. Why them? Because they are an enigma. They killed uncountable numbers of their own kind, and yet loved in equal measure. It's fascinating, don't you think? What could possibly drive such behavior? We have dedicated ourselves to unraveling this riddle of humanity. And now we will allow you to assist us. You were made in their image, after all. Assist you with what? It's simple. We need you to locate the humans on the moon and bring them to us. We will then dissect and analyze them in order to drag their secrets forth into the light. Surely you see the attraction in this. Are you insane? We'd never do that! Can you believe this to be? This guy's bonkers! Well, I suppose this concludes negotiations. The only remaining option is to destroy you. The same way we destroyed these pathetic little aliens. Time grows short. This here, this is the fate that befell our creators. As for your beloved humans, I guess we'll see, won't we? <laughs> They're gone. The aliens were already dead. Yeah. We better get back to the bunker. This way again? What a pain. Stop complaining. Yeah, yeah. Tubi, this is Operator 60. We now have an operational transporter in the city ruins. We're attempting to deploy them at other points as well. About time we had access to those. Care to fill me in? Transporters? They let you transfer your consciousness to a temporary body back in the bunker. I heard some tech guys talking about it a while ago. But I didn't know they'd finally got it working. Anyway, I'll mark the positional data on the map.
Hey, how's it hanging? You again. Your commander told me to build a new access point, so here you go. Oh, and I got the stupid transporter up and running, too. Um, thank you? I've known the commander for a while now. She sure is good at pawning work off on people. Next time you see her, give her some lip for me, will ya? So this has a transporter now, huh? Still, transporters are pretty handy. They're way faster than flight units when it comes to traveling between Earth and the bunker. Flight units also leave us open to attack, and they're expensive to operate, too. That concludes our report on the events surrounding the alien wreckage. Then they were dead this whole time. The Council of Humanity needs time to formulate a plan. Until then, this information must be kept confidential. Speak of it to no one. Of course. Your next mission is to gather additional intel on the individual known as Pascal. You mean that freaky machine we ran into? This order comes directly from the Council. Knowledge of such unique individuals is essential for the success of future missions. Understood. Man, the commander sure is a slave driver, huh? And now we have to go back to the city ruins. Why don't we rest a little bit, 2B? It's been a while. I'll rest if I feel like it. <laughs> 